Hey, what's going on everybody? This is Fragged Out, Swagged Out. You already know. Um, today I'm going to go over a couple of fragrances. Try to make it quick, get to the point. So I'm going to open up by saying big shout out to Equality Fragrance, the PG Maryland dude. Probably seen him on YouTube or somewhere in your Instagram. If you haven't, checked him out. He has really good content uh, and a really big, big collection of fragrances that if you wanted to try something and you wanted to know a little more about it, check his channel out. He's probably got it, and he's going to go over it for you. And he describes it really well. Uh, case in point, at this point, I'm so uh, sure that my fragrance taste and his are so aligned that if he likes it, I buy it. I don't even buy the sampling. That is not a recommendation. Do not do that if you're not sure. Um, I've been watching his videos for a while, and that's how I feel about his recommendations. This is one of them, Sultan by Royal Crown. This is a beautiful, sexy, elegant, mature vanilla. It has that Madagascar vanilla, it has dry fruits, it has dates, it has uh, cedar, and it has oud. And it is not that funky oud that people in the United States can't take. This is such a beautiful composition. Um, it's not the cheapest perfume you're going to buy, so get a sample if you're not ready to. Um, and then once you get the sample, I'm almost sure if you're in the neighborhood for something like this, you will cop. Um, Sultan Royal Crown. Equality fragrant uh, recommendation, um, so to speak. The next one is a recommendation from Troy D247 Mall, and this is EBK Perfume Ruby in Vanilla Intense. Not Ruby and, if you look it up for that, it's not the one. Ruby and Vanilla Intense. This right here is a very light vanilla. When I say light, I mean it's fresh, it's uplifting. It's it's just, it's a ruby. It's almost like translucent kind of um, smell. And I know those two things don't go together, but put that in perspective. It's just a light, refreshing vanilla. Um, ruby does it justice when you say that name. It's just light. It's beautiful. It lasts. The, the, the fact that it's light and refreshing as the vanilla, which is kind of uncommon because vanilla is typically a really thick kind of um, smell. But this right here, it stays on you. It it, it, it it gives an effect. People notice it. They want to smell it. They're going to talk about it if they're around you. There's nothing really to compare to this. Beautiful fragrance by EBK Paris. Um, again, Ruby and Vanilla Intense. The next perfume I'm going to go over, um, very similar name, same house. <laughs> Ruby and Vanilla Oud. This takes a very similar um, composition but they add oud to it. And this is an oud that anyone can get behind. Um, it's vanilla. It's clean. Just very well blended oud. An ambery smell that when as soon as it opens, you get that oud. You get that amber. You get that vanilla. And man, is it just amazing. And this will stay on you, on your clothes for up. Uh, when I say on you for hours for sure, on your clothes. For days, don't ask me how many hours. I don't do the hour count. I'm not going to tell you eight hours and then it runs out. I'm telling you, this right here is amazing. It's just sexy. It's seductive. It is thick, unlike this one. It has a very different vibe, but they're both vanillas. If you're wondering how to get in contact with an EBK um, a salesperson, because you're not going to find them in any store, uh, watch the Troy D247 YouTube video. If you put EBK Paris in Google or YouTube, He's the first video that pops up almost every time. Nobody's really doing videos on this. There's probably like two other reviewers. I don't know why. It's an injustice. These are amazing fragrances. But check him out. Uh, he'll, he'll tell you the rest. And lastly, um, Giuseppe Parfum, Accident a la Vanille. Um, man, this right here, there was no recommendation. This is a house that I feel doesn't get reviewed enough. And... I'm upset at that because sometimes I want to buy some fragrances and I have no idea what they smell like. Nobody's reviewing this or not enough people are. And they should because they're, they're not doing this company any justice by buying it and just keeping it in the dark. This is such an amazing, thick, opulent vanilla. Um, I, I want to say that these two are in the same vein, but it takes its own turn. You get rid of the, the spice. You get rid of the oud. This is just a thick, creamy vanilla sweet sexy um if you like vanilla you will love this and if you've ever thought to yourself vanilla is not for me you will hate this because this is like the embodiment of beauty when it comes to vanilla this is pure vanilla and the crazy thing is 
that of the four that I've just shown you, to include this one, this is the cheapest one. The 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 or, or I don't even want to say cheap. This is the least expensive one. It is smaller, but man, when I tell you that, when you talk about bang for buck, this is it. This is it. I, they have this is from their uh, noir line, and they go up to three hundred. I want to say three fifty for uh, for the bottles. This one is in the under two hundred dollars. And when I say that this is such a beautiful vanilla, I'm not going to say that it's the most unique. There's probably something else out there, but but just thick, opulent, um, long-lasting, long, long-lasting. You get your money's worth out of this bottle right here. Giuseppe Parfum Accident a la Vanille. Um, check it out. And there, there really aren't any reviews for this as far as I know, which is crazy. So I might do one later. I might post it here. I might post it on YouTube. Uh, I'm not really a YouTube person. Uh, I just like to do uh, take pictures of perfumes I have, and every now and then I'll do a video about stuff that really stands out. And then if I do it here, I'll upload it to a YouTube channel. There's only like two or three videos there. So um, if I do, I'll let you guys know. Uh, but this deserves more attention. All of these vanillas right here are just um, amazing, amazing vanillas. Check them out if you get a chance. And... Um, if you want to know more about this, like I said, check out some of the reviews. As I said, check out Equality Fragrance. Check out Troy D Twenty Four Seven Mall on YouTube, and like I said, they have a uh, an Instagram channel as well. Once again, I try to get to the point, even though I'm long winded sometimes. Fragged out, swagged out. You already know when I'm out.